All right, take nine, literally. I will put some of the other takes on here. Um, I haven't made videos for a while, and I should apologize for that, but life has just been chaos and crazy, okay? Just chaotic and crazy. <sighs> Work is going well. I'm slowly rebuilding my reputation. COVID destroyed my reputation. Not that I had a bad one to begin with. I didn't. And I'm not rebuilding from bad to good. I just have to rebuild good because my client base cycles out of the school every four years. So every year, I depend on word of mouth from when the freshmen come in. I depend on the word of mouth from the sophomore, juniors, and seniors who tell them where to go to get help with their classes. Okay. Well, COVID for two years, everyone cheated. I don't care what the teachers tell you, online school does not work. The students just cheat. They, they just cheat and there's no way to prevent it. S teachers will tell me, I've had these arguments with some teachers saying, well, it's good for them, they can't cheat. And I'm like, no, I can tell you how they're cheating. Because I know, I figured it out myself and then they told, verified by telling me. No matter what you do, they are going to cheat it somehow. There is a way. So online schooling just does not work. It's convenient for the teachers. They like it because they work for one hour. They're done. Great life. But it sucks for the students. And since we've gone back to in-person classes, I've heard nothing from the students but great. I'm happy to be here. This is the way it needs to be. All right. My life. I've been slowly cleaning up the house as a lot of you've seen in some of these videos, getting my life put back together. I do have a girlfriend now, and she's a wonderful lady, absolutely wonderful lady. I think her and I were made for each other, to be honest, and she feels the same way. We're not gonna go into it much more than that at this moment. You will know when it gets further along, I'm sure. I will announce it on Facebook. Let's just say I'm very happy with her, and I'm not going anywhere on her. Some of you told me to date around a bit. I did a little bit before I met her. Then once I met her and realized how much her and I get along, I quit. Okay, so it's just me and her. She hasn't met the girls yet. That's one of those things I'm being cautious with. I haven't met her children. Her children are adults. She has grandchildren the age of my children, which makes things a little funny at times. But she's very understanding, and again, I think her and I are, share each other half of our souls. So, like, she's half my soul and I'm half hers. Something I've never experienced before. I'm very, very happy with this. Um, model building. I haven't been doing much with it. I've been concentrating on getting the house cleaned up and getting my life straightened back up. With depression, I went through nine months of just, I mean... With divorce, depression was the right word, however. With divorce, I went through nine months of depression where I just didn't do anything but work. I worked, came home, turned on the TV. That was it. Um, I'm not doing that anymore. I've got almost this whole house cleaned up. What I mean by cleaned up, and I should phrase this correctly, is keeping the dirt and stuff out of the house is not a hard task. There's a Roomba that vacuums this house really well. He goes every two or three days. I don't have to vacuum the house. I don't have to sweep the house. Occasionally, I do mop the kitchen and stuff, mainly when the girls are here because they make messes. I don't. Jam carries things around the house, but he doesn't do much more than that. And Roomba gets what Jam leaves, to be honest with you. So keeping the house isn't too hard. Keeping it clean. It's clearing the clutter out of the house. That would be the best way to do it. Look at some of the old videos. You can see what this house looked like. Complete, complete disaster. Every single room was just stuffed with garbage. And I have moved literally a medium to large size U-Haul of stuff out of this house. And I'm on the second round of that now. Slowly going through every room and continually purging. I'm gonna get a purge down to the point where Clutter doesn't exist. There's so little stuff in the house, there is no clutter. That's what my goal is. <clears throat> yeah. Allergy problems today. Those that know my normal voice, you can hear it in my voice. 
I'm very heavily congested. The weather went to normal Texas weather of 95 to 98 degree days and 80 degree nights and then two days ago it dropped to 60 at night and it's 83, 84 during the day and my allergies just blossomed during this time. Whatever decided, I'm, whatever I'm allergic to decided to reproduce when the weather went this way. It's cloudy and rainy and allergies are way up. In fact, I could hardly breathe this morning. I couldn't see my eyes were so itchy. My throat was swollen. I'm better now. I'm getting better. We just need a couple of hot days and it'll clear up. Normal days. Hot for most of you. Okay. Normal days here are 98 to 100 degrees. It's going to be that way until September. Starting uh, June. It'll stay that way all the way through September. Those are normal days here. You just don't go outside in the summer unless you're crazy. Or you've spent a lot of time out there and you get adapted to it. I will be doing so soon. I've been exercising again, something I haven't done in a while. And that's good. Um, just letting you know, overall life is good. Model building, again. I did build a model this week. Start. No paint on it. Uh, but I'm going to do some detail painting on him. It was Woody from Toy Story 4, and I got Buzz Lightyear out. He's next. Those Woody kid is a, a really strange kid. Those arms are crazy. I did not like putting the arms together on Woody. The rest of it went together fairly well. No real confusion in the directions. I don't like the eyeballs because they independently move, kind of like this. I don't know if anyone can actually see that. Probably not with the lighting in here. But I can move my eyes like a gecko. A chameleon. Whichever way I want. Um, why do I keep looking over there? There's nothing over there but a window. Just gathering my thoughts by looking off in the distance. Yeah, everything's going well. Model building, I'm slowly getting back to it. Um, I'm going to put an update on the model channel in a little bit. If I can get the cameras working. Cameras weren't working this morning. Uh, the laptop I used to record with updated to Windows 11 and then all of a sudden no more audio on the cameras. Go figure. I will figure out what's going on with that. Most likely I just have to unplug everything and plug it back in and restart everything and it'll work. Um, yeah, outside all that, everything's going well. Everything seems to be good. Okay, business is slowly rebuilding. Life is good. Wonderful girlfriend. Jam is jam. He should replace Thunderpaws. He's been a good replacement for Thunderpaws. Every bit as much the little stinker the Thunderpaws was. Just nowhere near as big. Which might be good. The girls seem to like him. Corey, the dog, is slowly acclimatizing to the girls. He tolerates one of them with him at almost any given time now. Whereas three months ago, he would pee the floor if one of them came near him. Now one can sit there and pet him endlessly, and he just sits there with a little slight wag to his tail. So he's definitely getting better. We're working on him. He still needs more work because more than one girl there, and he's freaky. Uh-oh, I know what that was. Girlfriend again. Anyhow, I think I got this video done after nine tries. Wonderful! But just let you know, I'm working on Corey. He's getting better, okay? See, he'll soon be the family dog. And I need to clean this aquarium, which Big Gill is looking at me like, why are you neglecting me? The fish are healthy in there. That's why I haven't worried about it. The filter isn't working. The filter's offline. There's a lot of algae in the tank. And because the algae's in the tank, I think the fish are fine. It's filtering out all the fish waste. But it looks horrible. He's healthy. The fish in there are healthy. I, I'm not worried about them. Their health. The water quality is probably excellent with all that algae in there and all that plant life in there. Anyhow, I'm going to go. I'm going to see what I'm getting sent because I'm being sent an awful lot of stuff. All right, and I will be back. Hope you all enjoyed. Hello, everyone. I'm just going to ramble at the camera for a little bit. Um, I have allergy problems today. Hello everyone, doing an update. I have not been making videos as of late, like I should be, and I know that. A lot of that just... 
Hello everyone, um, just an update of what's going on. I haven't been making, we're on take four, five of this video because I keep screwing it up. Not in a bad mood, it's just I keep saying things I shouldn't on this video. All right, we're on take seven. Okay, I'm not in a bad mood. Jam is keeping me entertained. He found a little tiny ball upstairs and he's carrying it around and playing with it everywhere. He's ever present wherever I am in the house. Always helping me with everything. Sorry, that's girlfriend. We're gonna go to take eight. All right, we're on take eight or nine of this video, literally. Jam has interrupted it a few times. He's always my helper, as you will see in a lot of these future videos. Um, life is not going bad. 